Hey everyone, this is Max Edson, co-founder of Priced, and I'm gonna be going over our list upload feature with you today that provides you the ability to upload any list from any source that you want to have priced and create a campaign map. So this serves as a great alternative purpose if you have your own data tree account, your own RealQuest Pro account, or like downloading data from the county assessor's office. Now you can take that file, upload it to our system and have it priced and create a campaign map. So to begin, let's start with an example. I'm gonna choose this file and select it and then hit the upload list button. And from there, it's gonna go through processing, make sure we can read those records. And you're gonna notice that it's going to say 1,359 records or however many records are in your list. And from there, I'm gonna choose the option that I want. So you can see that we have list pricing, campaign map or list pricing and campaign map. For this example, I'm gonna go both. And then you see fields drop down below. So each field is important. So we're making sure that we're pulling the right columns of data. So you can see for the first one, for the pricing section, we have county field, state field, um, acreage field, or we can take the square footage field, either one. And then the city field is optional if you want us to price at the city level. So to choose the column accordingly to your file, I'm gonna click this drop down button and you're gonna see all of your column headers in this field. And I'm gonna to wanna to make sure to choose the county field that matches your, your field in the list that you just uploaded. So I'm gonna choose property county name and select that. But you'll also notice as a quicker method, there's gonna be a little smart price or smart tags down below. They, that's part of our system that you can go through and it just will automatically read those for you to kind of give you a helping hand. So if I wanted to select that, I could have easily done that and then choose these fields quick and easy and then go through my adjusting method for what kind of percent off I want as a percentage. So right now it's defaulted to 30, but what we can do is change that. So let's say I wanted 25%. I could easily change it to 25% and the pricing section is now good to go. So from there, I'm gonna move down to the campaign mapping section where I need my Latin long coordinates. So I'm gonna choose the Latin long coordinates, the 8 p.m. And then if I wanted the owner name in there, I could also do that. So I'm gonna choose this field. And once I have all those fields ready, I'm gonna click execute. And that's going to lead to all the processing, make sure that we're gonna pull those records. You can see that we've priced and mapped 1,359 out of 1,359, so this was a good pull. I can either preview my records or click purchase. And when you click purchase, what's gonna happen is there's gonna be a file that downloads right onto our page and it's gonna open up and you're gonna have all the, the fields appended. So let's say I wanted to look at my pricing new list that appends five fields to your actual list. So I'm gonna click it, I'm gonna open it up, and then I'm gonna go and slide all the way to the right where the fields are gonna be appended. And so now you're gonna see and notice that we have this priced market price, this priced market price per acre, the priced offer price, the priced offer price per acre, and then the pricing source. So you, this is a really cool way that now we've just appended all these pricings, these specific pricings to each one of your owner record quickly and easily. And as I can drag this down, you're gonna see they're all gonna be the same throughout um, the pricing and you can see the sources and everything that you would need to be able to send out a letter that's blind offer. So this is going to be the pricing um, list upload. So you can see that we've appended five different columns of data to your file. And then if you did the campaign map feature, what's going to happen is I'm gonna go through here, you're gonna see this KML file that's just compatible with Google Earth. And if I click it, it's gonna pop open Google Earth map really quick and easily. And it's gonna go through that and basically show your owner records on a map. So not only will it show those owner records on a map, but also the for sale and sold comps around those owner records. So it's a really cool visual, but also you can see all for due diligence now, if I wanted to select, an, uh, let's say, one of the APNs for the records that I just downloaded, and then I can go through here and I could select one of these records and it's gonna zoom right into it and then show me the for sale, the sold comps right around it. So I'll get great satellite imagery of the property itself, all the information of that owner record. And then if I zoom out, you can see the for sale and sold comps around it. So let's say you could see 359, 350, 229, 229. You can see everything in here, uh, which is really great for due diligence. So this is our list upload feature. I hope you enjoy. Please like, share, subscribe if you wanna learn more and enjoy.